Hello, my crafty friends. This is Jade at Sophistifunk. Um, I just wanted to share with you a couple of uh, quick mini albums I completed. They are the envelope uh, mini albums, mini albums, uh, Kathy Order style. Um, I just use uh, the tiny envelopes that you can get from Michaels and Hobby Lobby, I think. Um, so I just want to share what I did and I will try to make this pretty quick. I'll show you both. Um, I use the same paper line, but, uh, you know, in different orders and stuff. So, um, this is the, um, I use the paper line, this one, um, by Crate Paper. It's called Flea Market. Um, and as you can see, I had two of these actually. I used up all of the first um, pack and I have just this left um, for this one, um, for these two books. So, and I got a lot of scraps left as well. <clears throat> anyway, I, um, on the front, I just kept it really, really simple and just added a um, little pop-up sticker that says Moments. Um, added some ribbon on the side of here and some flat back pearls. Um, the spine is duct tape. It's white duct tape I got from the dollar store. And I just added ribbon on the back as well. Um, the closure is a hitch closure. They're Tim Holtz. Um, let's see if I have them on my desk. I thought I did, but I don't. Um, but they're um, Tim Holtz guys, and um, here they are. Sorry, these got them, picked them up at Hobby Lobby. So if you can see that, um, and I added that. Um, just punched a hole here, screwed in the hitch closure. See, there's a screw there. And then at the back, I added a, um, <clears throat> one of these, uh, an eyelet. And, um, a lot of people put the elastic under the, um, the paper. And I was going to do that, but I thought it might bulk it up too much. Um, it's already a little bulky from the ribbon over here and the, um, the hitch. So I, um, I decided not to do that and to just fold it over like that. And it works perfectly. So, and it was easy. I just stuck it in there and twisted it through and there you go. So <clears throat> anyway, <clears throat> let's get started in the front. I used the polka dots. Um, and then here you have photo um, mat for the first pocket um, and as Kathy Orta says these style mini albums has a lot of real estate for pictures and um, tags and journaling cards or whatever um, here is the closure down here and um, you can stick little tags and stuff here tag here <clears throat> And, of course, one here at the top. Now, I'll show you. And at the back, you can stick some right there, too. It'll fit if you want to. And here is another photo mat. Now, um, this is one set. So I don't know if, like, one thing together and then... We, the, another three and then another three so if you like this album I would look up Kathy Order Kathy Order uh, envelope mini album series and it shows she shows you how to do it you paste two envelopes together back to back and then that middle piece that's sticking up you make this piece here and glue it down and that's how um, it's basically that's the basic construction of it um, fairly simple and very fun to do. Um, here's another photo mat. 
Uh, more photo photo mats and tags. Here's a little tag. Another photo mat. And I kept it simple. I didn't do two different um, patterns on each side. I kept patterns the same on the photo mat. And I just think it's really turned out really cute. I love the size of it. And I actually didn't get using trying these uh, little envelopes from Kathy order um, Sarah at my serenity crafts uh, I was watching her uh, a video of her she had done the Kathy order uh, style and she had tr uh, also had tried these little ones and I said oh those are really cute so I made these for a couple cousins of mine, and I'm going to put, like, gift cards in them uh, for Christmas. So I was like, that's really cute. I think that's cute for them, um, a good size, especially since, you know, they don't exactly know what mini albums are or what they're for. So, um, you know, I just thought it was a good size for them, and uh, they were just really cute. And here's the last photo mat for this one. And here's the back, and that's it, ladies and gentlemen, for that one. Um, and the next one is this one. Um, and this one, the front of it just says, remember. So I just kept the front really, really simple. Um, like I said, these are my cousins. They don't really know what mini albums are or what they're for. I might have to explain. So I just wanted to kind of keep it quick and simple and not, you know, overdo it with embellishments and stuff on the front. So um, here is the inside. It's the first photo mat. And, and again, another you know, hitch style closure. Um, here's the tag for these. Sorry, guys, I've been battling a cold. You hear me sniffing, I'm sure. Here's the tag here. You got to put that one in the wrong way. Well, you can put it in any way you want to, really, but this, the paper is pretty cute. It's not my all-time favorite paper, but I like it. I really like the uh, Tiny Word um, paper there. It's one of my favorite ones out of the whole line. And here's another little tag. And I punched the uh, <clears throat> the tags. Uh, one side, this, the other album, I punched the tops with the scallop tag. And this one, I did this the ticket stub. Just to give them a little, a little small, tiny difference. Um, and of course, you know, I used different design paper on front and back. So, um, here's the other photo mat. Less tags and stuff. And less photo mat for this one. And that is how I styled the back there. So that's it. Um, I hope you guys liked. If you are interested in making this style <clears throat> mini envelope, Kathy Order has a um, uh, tutorial on her YouTube channel. Um, a series of tutorials about it. It's the Kath Kathy Order envelope uh, mini style series. I'll link it below. And um, 
another person who helped me out, Sarah from My Serenity Crafts, she also made her own um, series, um, a tutorial series using this style. Um, <clears throat> and some of her, her tutorial um, helped me understand um, parts of getting it together a little better than watching the Kathy order uh, one, particularly when doing the binding. Um, hers helped me a little better than the original. So I will actually link both below. Um, and I just wanted to say thanks for watching. If you have any comments or questions, leave them below and I'll catch you guys next time. Thank you. Bye.